And now the skater. So on this page, I've also drawn a stave at the top here to show you the five lines, how they're numbered from one all the way up to five. And the four spaces, how they're numbered from number one at the bottom all the way up to number four. Then you've got your bass clef sign and I've put the four space notes on the bass clef stave and reading from the bottom, they read A, C, E and G, which to help you remember that we've learnt all cows eat grass. Then I put the five lines and the letters that go with those in our bass clef. OK, so in the lesson, I was asking you to try and identify that first note that we play in the left hand here and asking you to count how many lines um, up the stave that note came on. All right. So if you're counting from the bottom line, one, two, three, that third line, which that note is printed on, is note D. So that's what we know that first note is with our fourth finger. The other thing we need to make note of is I've put there that there's an F sharp in the key signature. So every time I play an F sharp or F, I need to remember that it's got to be F sharp and it's always going to be your second finger in this piece of music. OK, so I'm going to play from the beginning, counting three beats in a bar. Off we go. One, two, three, G, two, three, G again. skip between E and G, then F sharp, then F sharp again, and E, two, three, now I'm here, G, two, three, next line, start with G again, F sharp, two, three, in this bar we've got that skip again, F sharp, then finish with D, E, F sharp. 